So today, we are creating our very own Super Witch by combining all three witches into one deck. 4.0 Elixir Triple Witch Jaisalin Clone, the ultimate swarm deck to overwhelm and destroy in one push only. If your opponent does not have enough splash damage, there's literally nothing they can do. With your witch spawn skeletons, net witch spawning bats, and the mother witch turning everything into pigs, then drop that clone spell and watch your opponent's tower disappear. So let's go ahead and unleash our Triple Witch witch destruction on some unsuspecting opponents. So here we go jumping in against the silver potato. My red? Oh, okay. If we go a mother witch here, it might turn that one into a piggy, which blocks the dark prince damage, right? Yo, let's go, dude. Okay, all right. Now, I kind of want to go a night witch clone here left lane. We have zero idea what he's got in his deck, but maybe, just maybe, we... Oh, no. Mm, I mean, maybe? Nah. That's not going to work. Either way, though, Night Witch gets in there. Mother Witch right lane. John Bomb knocks the Witch dragon back. We get a couple of Night Witch shots to that tower. We get a little bit of tower damage done. Obviously, this early in the battle, getting tower damage isn't your primary focus. For the most part, you want to just focus on surviving until the double extra period. Because your deck is so expensive, it is hard to afford a Giant Skeleton plus the Clone Push. So ideally, primarily play, play defense and save up all of your elixir for the double extra period. He obviously has a pump down. It's going to be a golem beatdown deck. His nano's going to be on rotation. I don't know if he's got Lenny spell. If he does, this could be a problem. If not, we might be vibing. But we shall find out. So we're going to go a fly machine plus a night witch here. Come on. Destroy the minions, please. Yes, sir. Now, don't die, fly machine, please. Yes, survive. Destroy the E dragon. Boop, let's go. But the problem there is we did not punish that pump adequately. Go one push. Another oh, he's gonna go one more pump. Okay, this is our opportunity, my friend. This is our opportunity to shine. We're entering the double period right now. We're gonna go skeleton barrel here, left lane. Giant skeleton up front. Clone everything. And then destroy Mr. Silver Potato's hopes and dreams. Go home going down. Let's go a fly machine here. Where's your Skarmory, my friend? Where is it? Close it all down. Boom. There we go. Yes, sir. And now we need it all together here. Got the destroy. <laughs> Delightfully devilish. Nail going down, but Giant Bomb number one explodes. That one little Larry in the back. Do y'all see him just putting in the work, putting in the effort, destroying that tower? He's still going. <laughs> How much damage does that guy do? Give him a raise. He deserves a raise, my friends. Oh my goodness, that was hilarious, dude. All right, let's go. Let's go. Clone right here, please. Boom. That giant bomb should explode and destroy mostly everything. If we get those two skeleton builds to that tower, boom. Boom, one more. Yo. Check out that damage, my friend. Check out that damage. Mother Witch right here. Turn a few of those minions into piggies. Now it's up front here. Come on, come on, come on. I will turn the Dark Prince into a piggy. Either way, it's a, a pig is a pig. A pig is a pig, my friends. And it gets in there. He's going to give up. He's going to give up. Yes. <laughs> Silver potato getting destroyed by the triple witch clone beatdown. Let's go. Hello, piggies. <laughs> I'm going to go witch over here. Should destroy both sides pretty respectfully. I might actually go for a quick little giant something clone push here, my friend. I know we're early in this battle and it's somewhat crazy, but maybe this works. Wait for the eSport to go down first. Then we go clone. What do you got for this? Ooh. You know what? I, I saw that coming, but I still want to go for it anyways. <laughs> it's going to be a Rover Recruits Rural Hog Fly Machine. <laughs> he misses the fireball. Let's go, dude. Okay. I'm going to go with a quick little skeleton barrel here. Clone this all up because he's going to go Goblin Cage in the middle. So maybe the Fly Machine's destroyed. He's going to go Barbell for that now. Locks it down, but he misses a few skeletons. Lost the Fly Machine to survive. Gets one more shot, two more shots. Yo, let's go. Considering we don't even really want to try for tower damage earlier in the battle, we're at purely defense mode, waiting for the next period. I'm definitely okay being at 1,400 tower damage. Let's start slow rolling a Night Witch to your left side. I want to get a Giant Skeleton for this lane. That'll also tank that Fly Machine as well. Then maybe we can counter push into something. We'll see how it goes. Yo. That fly machine is not within tower range? What? That's right. <laughs> Check yourself, my friend. Fly machine should get a fireball left lane here. Get a fireball fly machine plus the night witch. Or not. Okay. Well, ignore me. Come on. Get in the skeleton barrel. Where's your goblin cage, my friend? Bats go in. Fly machine locks on. Drive to the right lane. Yo. Look at that tower damage. 
My machine still locks on. And there we go. 246 health. I really wish we could have cloned that giant to the right lane at the last moment, but we just did not have enough elixir. Either way, we're sitting on a massive damage lead to kick this battle off, and we're just entering double period right now. So listen, this is looking perfectly well what we want to do in this battle. Let's go a Night Witch here, please. Come on, Night Witch. Take that fly machine, please. Fly machine up front. Let's go. Turn them piggies into piggies, my friends. Yes, sir. And the witch goes in left side. Let's go. Quick, let's skeleton barrel over here. We know that he's gobbing kids on our rotation right now. So we can clone this down here. He's got no watch more clones. He's pulling that skeleton barrel. barrel. Oh, they should get in there. Get some damage on that tower. Come on, skeletons. Yes, sir. One more shot. Yes. The cloned witch clutching it up. Let's go, dude. Let's go, Jack. Skeleton over here, right lane. Ignore those zappies left side. He might try and go for. Oh. Go night witch here, my friends. This is a respectful play. I like it, dude. I like it, my friend, a lot. Let's close back here. Let's go. Come on. Get in there, please. Push into the tower. Yes, sir. That should get that tower dead. Why giant bomb exploding here, destroying his tower. That's all I need to get this victory. Boom, baby. Let's go. I was a little bit concerned that we lost our tower left lane. I'll be honest. Either way, never doubt the power of the giant skeleton bomb. So I'm gonna set this battle off here with a skeleton barrel left lane. Just to try and see what he's got in his deck as a response and hard counter for our deck. We see Zappies, which indicates it could be a real giant deck, skeleton king deck, or a royal hogs. We shall find out more information shortly. I'm gonna go a fly machine over here, left side, just to destroy these Zappies and figure out what the rest of his deck is. I need to know before we start going on offense. Ooh, Dark Prince. Makes me think it's gonna be a RG deck, to be honest. We're gonna see how it goes though. Fly machine goes in. Yo, a giant skeleton, okay. That still basically points towards a Royal Giant deck. With Earthquake, potentially? Yo, I definitely think it's RG. I definitely think it's RG. We'll kind of see how it is. Because you never know in Clash Royale, sometimes you get surprised. But uh, look at this witch. Just gets to throw that giant bomb. Boom. And she is out of here. Come on, one more shot. Skeletons go in. So he has not used the Arch Queen ability yet. So what I want to do right now is I want to go with a quick little giant skeleton for this. Just smack her down. And then we're going to go something barrel over here. Clone this all up. He does not have a building. <gasps> He's going on Scarby? Bro. And a NATO? Double bro. Get in there, skill. Ah, oh, dude. <laughs> okay. Um, maybe it's not RG. The NATO in there, the skill to army, makes me think potentially not Royal Giant. I don't know. <laughs> we'll find out soon, though. I thought it was RG, but then now we just don't know. We're alive. His tower's alive. We're kind of all doing okay. We're kind of all having some fun. I kind of want to get a giant skeleton left lane. We got to. We got to go giant skeleton here for this arch queen, right? Or we just need to put back, right? Y'all ready for this? Yoink. Wait for it. It's going to destroy my fly machine because she is busted. But... We did not most of that tower damage. Let's start slow rolling a regular witch over here left lane to spawn out some skeletons to distract that giant skeleton. Now he might opt to NATO it in to the giant skeleton range. We shall she shall see. Shall see how it goes, rather. Sorry. Come on, witch. I see your fireball, my friend, but do you have anything else for that? That's the question right now. Ah. I don't think so. You can go Archer Queen left lane. Get some more skeletons out, please. Come on. Let's go and go fireball here. I want to get a skeleton barrel up front potentially, and then I kind of want to go. Uh, he's, he's got he's back to fireball right now, so I want to just chill. I want to just chill here for a hot minute first. Come on, witch! Jump explodes, destroys the archer queen. Yes, sir. Does he go ability here? He does not in time actually, so we are good with that. Let's go, Jackal over here, outside of the range of that giant bomb. Both of them stay alive here. Yes, sir. And now we go in for the massive clone counter push of the sentry. He might fireball it all down, but even if he does, it's not enough. There's fireball number one. Where's your NATO, my friend? Where is your NATO, buddy? I know you want to use it. <laughs> Come on. Get in there, by the way, please. Give me some piggies. Another one. Oh, that's Garmy's dead. But we still get some piggies from that. From the Zappies there. Two witches still alive. Another Third one. Third witch going in there. And it's too much swarm. He cannot keep up. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Even with all of the answers, it is not enough. And we have ourselves a one crown victory. And you know what? He's having a good time. So, so are we. Oh my goodness, another Archer Queen. Yo, Archer Queen for days in Clash Royale these days, eh? So when you go to that over here, left lane, because even if he goes ability, the Giant Bomb can destroy. We'll see how it goes, my friend. Oh, that's bad. 
The elite barbarians of destruction. I'm gonna go flying machine up high to hopefully start snapping away at this elite barbarian here. The one skeleton should distract the giant bomb explodes, destroys the archer queen. Boom, let's go, dude. Yes, sir. Nato's that in, but the archer queen is dead. We might opt for a quick little clone here. Ready? Boom. Come on. Come on, witch. Get in there. He goes bar build right here, right? What does he got for this? Zaspel. He misses the skeletons. The witch is too OP. There's too hey, many hey, skeletons. Hey, hey, hey. And the tower just went down, and we had the voice crack of the century ruining that epic moment. I do apologize, my dear friends, but we are dominating this battle so far. You love to see it when you're facing Archer Queen the lead barbarians. Having a one crown lead this early on is always a good day. Come on, Nightwitch, can you please? I'm gonna save my giant skeleton because we know. He has the elite barbarians in there. I want to be very, very uh, conscious of what we're spending our elixir on and make sure we always have enough elixir to defend a potential elite barbarian push because we know he wants to go elite barbarians. And even with that NATO, even with the NATO, the cannon cart is still immobilized. Giant skeleton, skeleton barrel, and potentially clone. Are you okay? Uh, we can't afford a clone, though. We can't afford a clone. But Slime Machine gets in there. He zaps the skeleton down. The giant bomb should destroy that giant skeleton. Because I'm not much bat spawning out here. And I really kind of want to nail this all. If there's anything else in here, or is that giant bomb exploding and hit it anyways? <gasps> Ooh, let's go witch here, my friends. Let's go witch. Fly machine as well. Skeleton's pulling away. He's back to a nato, but we need us all together right here. Bow is the leap barbarian off my tower. And we save the tower for the victory with no damage done. I think you got one of the barbarian shot, but who's counting? Let's go clone right here, my friend. Boom. Yes, sir. He has to go a zap here, right? He does. But either way, the double witches. Infinite distraction, infinite spam, and infinite swarm. He's got no chance. The king of kings being dethroned by little old peasant Shane. And now we are the king, my friend. Mr. King of Kings, look at me. I am the captain now. Wait, that's not a king. That's a captain Shane. Oh, sorry. I apologize. I'm going to go to, uh, double witch clone over here right lane and that is it my friends good game well played one crown victory you'll love to see it let's keep it going over here my friends oh hello Mr. Fish are you fish or ham I can't decide which one you are either way I will eat you regardless <laughs> I'm going to go now what's your oh it's going to be a pack up bridge bam deck I think right Ben is going to charge in here pack up bridge bam with e-wizard and potentially a magic archer fireball here for my flying machine maybe Sir? Poison! Mm. Why is it whenever I use clone, I instantly face poison? Clash Royale? Explain yourself, please. Why is it as soon as I use clone, it's like, Shade, he's gonna have E-Wizard, he's gonna have NATO, he's gonna have poison, he's gonna have literally everything you don't wanna face. Somebody explain that fact to me. Is that just Clash Royale saying, Shane, we don't like you, get out of our face? Or is that just me being like, Shane, you're using clone deck, that's what you gotta expect, my friend. So. Let's go. <gasps> I don't want a single comment about that clone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> how does that how does that happen, Clash Royale? Oh yeah. That better not get a shot. Oh, it totally was. Ah, yeah, dude, we're so dead. So we're gonna play some solid defense to come back from that misplay early. We're gonna go Nightwitch over here. He does have Magic Archer and the Poison. Uh, so this could be a bit of a more difficult battle with Poison, Magic Archer, and Eddie Wizard in there for splash damage for Mr. Official Ham. But maybe, just maybe, we can still make the magic happen. Oh, there's definitely no magic happening today, my friends. Definitely not, boys and girls. Uh, let's go over these. This clone spell should clone that up. Double them go boom. Boom, baby. Oh, that pack is alive still, bro. That tower's gone. Yeah. Wait, he's got NATO too. Why does he have so much blast damage in there? Well, that was basically what I expected. This guy has so much blast damage. Poison, NATO, Log, Magic Archer, and E-Wizard. I'm just not too sure what we could have done with a clone deck. So here we are against Dan, the man. The man with the plan. We're gonna go double piggies over here. Mother with... Oh, Boulder, that's not what I want to see. That hard counters half of my deck. 
the bowler is not my preferred card to face because typically they have a lot more splash damage to synergize with that bowler like nados and nados and also more nados so we'll kind of see how this goes oh no come on bowler goes okay jackson goes in there which goes down okay he does have splash damage but if i clone this down and nado this in here we might get that jump onto the tower please <gasps> it does come on jump bomb Fly machine destroy! Double fly machines and the bomb explodes! Boom! Tyrant goes down! One crowd lead! Come on, Mother Witch, give me some piggies, please! What do you got for this? What do you got for this? That should be infinite piggies, right? He's got he's gonna go bowler here, he's gonna give up. Mr. Dan! Mr. Dan! The man! Where's your plan? I thought you had a plan! Let's go witch over here. That that's a good plan. That's a good plan. I don't have anything to counter that, my friend. That is a respectable plan there, boy. That, that is respectable. I got nothing for that. I I, I got nothing. I literally got nothing. <laughs> I literally got nothing, boys. Oh, uh, where'd he go in here? I think he gave up, though. I think he threw. I think he just arrows the corner uh, for no reason. I mean, we'll try. We'll see how it goes. What does he got for that? Nato's that bound. Let's let's go in there. Yo, our Skarmy wins the Skarmy? Do we three crown? <laughs> Yo, just like that. Okay. Wow. That was absurd. Good game, Dan.